Hi everyone, I am Mazalaman. Welcome to C Corp Holiday Special. It is a DLC or downloadable content for To the Moon. And it's about 20 minutes long, so not very long at all. It, it stars the two main protagonists of the main game To the Moon Dr. Eva and Dr. Watts. And. The reason why this is separate from the main game was according to the author of this game, so it shouldn't that this game shouldn't or this particular story shouldn't interfere with the main game and the main story. So, yeah, and also this game has no city mechanic and it just kind of starts. So, sorry for blabbering by a little bit, but okay. Let's start with this game, I suppose. C Corp or Sigmund Corporation. Holiday special. This is Dr. Watts just walking around. Probably in his own off office, I'm guessing. Oh. <laughs> I can already see what you're doing there. Good job. <laughs> hey, Eva. Come to my office, I've got something. Neil, where are you? The meeting started an hour ago. What? <laughs> Falling for your own trap. Congrats. Wait, there's no meeting today. Yeah, and I'm not dumb. <laughs> Twice in one day, really? Besides, that's actually dangerous. What if it hits my head without tipping over? Yeah, it might hurt you a little bit. But it still made it hit my head. That's different. Yours is pretty, th pretty thick. <laughs> well, I still got you once. Excuse me for giving you a chance to even, even the scores. But seriously, drop by. I actually do have something to show you. Just give me a few thirst. You can I say hi to them at the party downstairs? Maybe later. Grab me a drink if you go. Alright, so we're in Sigmund Corporation. There's a background over there. There's doors everywhere. Can I do stuff? Office of Dr. Willis Macmillan. There's nothing here apparently, and there's a shiny thing. Office of Dr. Lisa Vasquez. This is Office of Dr. Eddie Doyle. It's locked. That was locked. Office of Dr. Tama Macmillan cool names and this is what the bathroom okay anything to do with this oh yeah and I noticed moonwalking we're just gonna do that and okay there's nothing much more here this probably says bathroom right dot wait really dr. washroom is that really his name or is that a that's probably a that's probably a pun. Maybe I should use the enter key instead. Okay, I can go there. And this is Eva's office, Doctor of Eva Rosaline. Good. Ah uh, man, this is weird. Okay. Neil Watts. What is in here, perhaps? Anything special? Just this. Let's see what it is. Di Dear diary, today I should. I can't just leave my diary out like this. Better lock it away before someone sees. Maybe that would have changed the story a little bit? I don't know. Hopefully not. What else is in here? Office of Tower Rob Lynn and Roxanne Winters. And they're also locked, right? Yeah. Let me guess another doctor. Oh, not. Logan Postwell. And that's locked. Okay, good. So now that I've successfully wasted everyone's time, let's go ahead and get this story going. I don't want this LP to take too long. Oh hey, that same ringtone. What? I just remembered. Could you also get me some cake with that drink? How do you know there'd be cake? There's always cake, and I want it. Well, pick one. I'm not your waitress. Hey, so which is it? You gotta choose it yourself. Neil? 
I'm thinking. Look, I gotta go. I'll call you back. What? Oh, hey, oh, hey, Roxanne Winters. I read your name once. Roxy, you are right? Huh? Oh, well, we went outside to get something from the car and... Well, you know... Them again, huh? Well, it is that time of the year. Look, don't tell the others, okay? I don't even... I don't want anyone to be all tensed up about it. Hmm, maybe it'll be all cleared up by the time everyone leaves. I hope so. Come on, let's go see what the others are up to. Mm-hmm. Huh. Maybe there is something going on upstairs? Hey, I thought we were going down to the party. Okay, yeah. I just wanted to check something first. Can I check it? Okay, I can check it. So can I... Kneel? Okay, there's the door is locked. Which is good. No answer? The lion's busy. Huh. Something happened to him. Or maybe not. Good try, but there's no water bucket this time. Is everything okay? You seem distracted. Hi, Anil. Yeah, it's all good. And they... And hey, Rock. Sheesh, I told you to quit... quit uh, like that. Yeah, well, tough luck. Anyway, anyhow, I'm just about wrapping this up. I'll call you when it's done, Eva. And I'll, I'd show you too, Rock, but it's totally top tier NDA stuff. Huh? Don't ask. <laughs> okay, back to work. Huh. What's going on? I don't even think I need the mouse, so I'll put it away, I guess. I'll just use the arrow keys on the enter key, because that's what the K manual told me, that I only need to use these. If I need to use the mouse, I'll try to use it, I guess. But for now, it seems more like a distraction instead of it actually being useful. Even though it tells me to use the mouse, I'll use it soon. There's a lot of stuff here. There's presents. Can I interact with them? No. I can interact with people. Hi. Hey, well, it looks like Logan's pulling a move on your girl over there. Wait, what? <laughs> she ain't going anywhere. Oh, I don't know, Willis. Logan does sing like an angel. I do? Yeah, Willis. And I heard he's an exquisite dancer, too. I am? Well, I got three strands of hair on my head, and each one of them is willing to fight him in the parking lot. Okay, this is getting too weird for me. <laughs> Hi there. I'm not really sure what to do here, Eva. Since we've a full house today, Eddie was allowed to drink, but now we won't stop talking. Maybe he just needs some thing to someone to listen to, I guess. Or was like that, I don't know. Yeah, that's what I fear the most. And you there. You know what bugs me, Lisa? We can alter memories, yet I can neither make my hair as buya Booyant as Logan's, nor as silky as yours. Yeah, it's a yeah, it's a tragedy. Nice hat. Eva, my dear. Good afternoon, Taima. You know, you never responded to that email I sent you about my new nephew. Uh, attached a photo of him and everything. Uh, thanks, but I'm just not looking. Oh, it's that boy Neil. Boy Neil, isn't it? What? No. I like to keep my personal and professional life separate. Wow, then that's just one more reason why my nephew is perfect for you. You two are gonna be so happy together. <laughs> hey, Eva. Hey, how did you that last mission go? I heard you guys ran into some complica complications. It was fine. But our siege just got in the way. But I'm trying to forget about work now. There's enough of that to go around later. Tama and I are discussing our tastes in early pork paintings. They're all good. Yes, yes they are. That's good. And what about you? Anything on the cake I can see? No. So, 
Look, I know it's hard to not think about it, but worrying doesn't fix anything. I know, but... What was your last patient's wish? Huh? Oh, well, she wished to see the world. And did she? Yeah, we took her all over. I even caught glimpses of places that I haven't been to. She was so happy. It sounds like she would have really appreciated what you did for her. Hmm. You've helped a lot of people, Roxy. I'm sure if they could speak to you, they'd all tell you. What's out there right now doesn't change that. I guess so. I do feel better thinking of that. Thanks, Eva. It's the holidays. Don't let it ruin the mood. What? Dear love fixer. Come on. Okay. It's the holidays. Don't let it ruin the mood. Mm-hmm. Alright, anything else I can do here? Doesn't seem like it. I can just talk to more people, but I don't think that'll change anything. Cake. Maybe I need to take cake. Can I take cake from here? Drink? Cake? No? Maybe this? No, nothing. Go have a good time, Eva. Okay. Is Neil Kukunik himself on his office again? I think that's the right word for it. Okay, keep dreaming. You got no clue, alcoholic. <laughs> Where's Neo? In his office. Yeah, nobody seems to know anything about it, and I can't seem to be able to click on anything. I can't wait for the next big snowfall. Yeah. Oh, hi, there's a new person. Hi there. How are you doing? Come back here. Where are you going? Don't go out right now, Eva. I know. Roxy told me. Those persistent buggers. Looks like they're, they're there to stay. Oh, there's, so there's like kind of... There's a kind of... Yeah. It's ready, Eva. Come over when you can. Uh, so, so there's a kind of... I'm guessing like... Strike going on over there, and nobody's like, No, we don't want this and we don't want that, right? Okay, I was messing around a little bit, didn't know what to do really. I mean, I could have talked to the other people again and again, but I didn't think that would be the case. Oh well, seems like he's ready. So, what have you got for me, or us, or anyone? Shut the door, or why? Because I'm supposed to be using this computer for work, remember. If Rob saw me, he'd be all like slacking off again, Neil. Durr. What is that? Here, have my seat. What is it? Remember that? Oh yeah, I remember that. Please tell me you folded it yourself. Lighten up. There were hundreds of them. Besides, it's not like Lily and the kids have any use for them anyhow. And what good is it to you? Jumpstart into your memory up for one. Now, I launched that prog program. I don't know if I want to. Oh, come on, you've worked hard. I worked hard on it. What program is it? What are you gonna do? To the moon. A game by Neo. What? Press enter to start. <laughs> really? <laughs> Ta da! This is just plainly disrespectful. Hey now, video games are an art form. They passed the laws decades ago. Yeah, but this might make them revoke it. Sticks and stones, Eva. You haven't even played it yet. Go on, try it. Okay, I'll press the enter key and... Um... <laughs> sure. Why not? Uh-huh. Okay. 
this is a game, and that's a lighthouse, and that's the sun and stuff. And what is this? Oh, this is zombie Eva. <laughs> Looks familiar. <laughs> I bet Eva will love it. Oh my God, I lost. I lost a life. What if I actually lose at this game? Do I die? Did it? Did it? Well, I can do this. Take my life back. I got a bunny. And down there is nothing. Now I can do something like, I don't know, this. Oh. I can just... Okay, sure, why not? This is a video game that I'm playing inside of a video game. That's good. I love playing video games inside of a video game. I like playing a video game inside of a video game sometimes. There's stuff moving around places. It's like... It kind of sort of feels like that one game that I played once. Or was it like... Ships Challenge? Reminds me a little bit of that. And a little bit of... Uh, that one game. Its name is... What is that game? It's called... Um, oh hi, that's... Stuff. Yeah, it really looks like Ships Challenge now. It looks like... What is the one game? Hexaplex. Hexo... Hexaplex? Superplex. Yeah, there we go. That's the one. It reminds me... Like, it's like a combination of those two, plus like, I don't know... The pattern of the squares... Reminds me a little bit of... Uh, World 3 from Super Mario... Um... Or... What was it? Super Mar Pap Super Paper Mario, there, there we go. Super Paper Mario for the Wii. And now this is remind starting to remind me of... The World's Hardest Game. Because why the hell not? Anything here? Heart? And I get to open this. And I get to move onwards. Why do we need this game? I used to make games like this when I was your age. You know, talking about making games, I also made a game once. It's called Castle Plus Sploder. You can find the trailer on my channel and stuff. And yeah. What the top tired in the A stuff, huh? How long have you guys been standing there? Seems like you've been slacking off again. Man, I told you he'd stay that. Get out of my office, you guys. This is my private space. Shoo, shoo. <laughs> well, you know, it is called a holiday, and on the holidays you're supposed to slack up and not do work, you know? See, Eva, this is exactly what happens when you leave the door open. I might as well... I might as well as go stretch my leg, just realize you didn't get me a drink. You can keep on playing, though. I'm just gonna keep playing? Okay then. Why not? <laughs> what is that? Apparently not a lot. Yeah, I got a book. And um, where do I put this book? Not over here, apparently. Let's get our hearts back, I guess. Um... Is this a puzzle of some sort? I don't even know. What are these things? Brains? Now do I touch them? I don't get the point of this game. But it's a game nonetheless, I guess. And now there's... This is just getting silly. That blue thing has like no pattern at all. Actually it does have a pattern, but you know. And now these brains have no... Thing... Next to them. And I can give this thing to you. And okay, apparently that was the thing. This is quite a silly game. Uh, 
Um. Okay. That was a thing. Now I can go through doors and stuff. And go to the moon or whatever. Yeah, I want I'm going to the moon right now. That's the moon right there, and there's this guy. Girl. This is turning out to be a lot different than what I was thinking it would be. Oh, it's this part. Who doesn't remember that part? Oh yeah, and you people. Or, you know. And now... <laughs> he was probably like... That's it. He was probably thinking like this. That's garbage. <laughs> and now watch goes back and see that Eva is not there. Hey Eva, did the dot dot dot. Okay, I can't do anything about that anymore. Anything else in here? Nope, doesn't seem like it. Eva? What's up? Why are you not back in here? You're probably downstairs again. There's nothing else over here. Nope, nope, and nobody, nope. I'm gonna go ahead and guess that there's nothing over there too. I'm gonna put my arrow over there for a moment, and nope, there's nothing over here. Okay. Let me go back downstairs because that's where I think I'm supposed to go. Even though, how did you miss Eva going over there? Hi? And then we're all like, feel my hair, feel it! Man, I, I'm never drinking more than a shot of beer again. But seriously, I made some of them my ringtone. Oh, sorry about that earlier. Uh, what happened earlier? You weren't there. You weren't there? Good, at least someone didn't see. My head's still dizzy, I almost makes me f want to take off my hat. But then... Yeah. Heard you were playing some game in your office again, huh? Rumors, clearly. When did you, where did the others go? Well, it's some time I left for home and I don't really know where Robert went. I'm surprised nobody here got called today. It was nice to have a peaceful gathering. Uh, we've, al we've already delayed the party cause Lisa and Eddie got called in last week. And yet you still don't come down to mingle with us. <laughs> right. Anything else? This cake sure wasn't well received today. I'll have to bake a better one next time. I'll have a piece, but right now I need to find Eva. Huh. Haven't seen her. Psst, Neil. What, do you know something? Are you looking for Eva? Yeah, how do you know? I just saw her down, down the hall looking upset. Wait, why is that assumed... To be my fault. Well, when you look when I look at your face, I get the feeling that you would piss me off a lot if you were my partner. <laughs> but I mean, that is the nicest way. In what way could that possibly be nice? Never mind. Look, thanks for the info. I'll go check upstairs. Anything else? You can use the elevator and take a right. Do they? I've worked here for years. Yeah. Sometimes you can forget things even if you work somewhere for years. Like some, just one, that one day you're gonna be like, where the hell am I? I have no idea where I'm at. So she told me to take a right, which I'm gonna assume that was... Oh, down the elevator. Okay, I couldn't come here before. There's nothing here for me to see. Now I'm going outside and this is the outside of Sigmund Corp. Not quite. But this is a place. I've seen the screen. This is the end screen. Hey! You didn't finish the game. I've played enough of it. Don't tell me you're upset about the Zambivas. Zambivas. You made them yourself, don't you remember? And if it was clearly a joke, sheesh. I'd ask when you had become so uptight, but, you know. Come over here, Neil. 
Are you gonna punch me? I've been practicing my Kara Kwan Chun, you know? I'm telling ya, my hands are like lightning, even I can't contain my moves. <laughs> Apparently she's not aiming to punch you. Or maybe she is. You never know. They're looking at the window. Whoa! Record show up, huh? Record show up. Roxy said they've been gathering since morning. Can I see the picture of myself too? Like looking out of the window? That's quite some dedication for no pay. When I signed up for this job, I thought it'd be re respectable, fulfilling dreams and all. But those who thank us are dead, are the dead, and those who support us are the, the dying. You might not like how I I do things, but I do them for the patient's sake. And more often than that, than I'd like for yours to save your sorry ass, sorry ass from getting fired. <laughs> yeah, good job with that. It's a feat. Do you think they're they're right? Hmm. All those people out there, they are all standing for what they think is right. Gee, I sure hope not. But hey, everybody has their p beliefs. There are a lot of them, but don't forget that there are, are a lot of people with us too. Remember Lily? They aren't as outspoken because those two are content, content rarely find the need to bother. But we have to remember that they're out there, and remember each patient we've once visited. Remember how hard we, we tried and how they left this world with a smile in the place of a frown? Sometimes that fleeting moment of shared happiness is all it takes to make it all worth it. Are you drunk, Neil? Hey, I'm just recycling Rob's BS here. Give me a break. But look, if what you're asking me whether that we do matters, I guess it does, for that brief fraction of a second before they pass on. Is that enough for you? Sometimes I don't really know. How about you? Are you really happy doing this? Hey, I'm just happy if that we make a lot of dough. Don't know about you, but I'm really... I'm totally ballin'. <laughs> At the grocery, I'm all like, heck yeah, I'll sell out five cents for a plastic bag. Here, a quart here's a quarter. That's how I roll. <laughs> you know, that game you made of it, it wasn't all terrible. I'm listening. I mean, the graphics are antique, and the gameplay is a pushover, but are... I'm surprised you still remembered all that Johnny and River stuff. Yeah, sorry about the Zambivas. But hey, you should, shouldn't really play it till the end. All the Zambivas really rally together and become the heroes to save the day. Really? Totally. And there's uh, like fireworks and pom-poms and as well, all the Johnnies and Rivers chant your name. <laughs> I guess I should go finish it then. Whoa, whoa, let's not be hasty. The game's not give going anywhere. You can go finish it in uh, one, no, two weeks. He probably hasn't added that in yet, I'm guessing. Hello? Thanks for this discount, but we're not looking for premium snow plowing service right now. You should encode your r number. That'll block most of the telemarketers. Just kidding, we're actually being drafted by a patient in critical condition. Wait, what? Understood, we'll be right over. Are you serious? Yeah, come on, we can't afford to be late. You can't just joke around about these things. You're serious? Neil? I wonder who that new patient is. And what's their problem? They don't like the fact that... 
Well, I guess there's both benefits and uh, unbenefits, disbenefits, rebenefits, something like that, for that. So, I mean, if you want to go to the moon and you, your entire memory of your past needs to be changed for that, then at the same exact time, you know, you forget everything about your past, in which case that would probably be bad in some case, but, you know, to be able to have a f happy, you know, when you get old and you have something very nice to look back to, like in the past, then I believe that's very good. Even if that means that you're basically lying to yourself, I still feel like looking so back to your good life is a good thing. Like, for example, I wouldn't have anything to look back to. And there's a bird story, which I'm going to be... There was... yeah. Download this mini so it's bonus tracks for free. Google a bird story OST. Which, a, pay, a bird story is the thing that I'm going to play right after this. About 20... Not even 20 minutes, 8 minutes from now. So, I'll be looking forward to that, I guess. Thank you everyone for watching. This has been Sigmund Corp Holiday Special for Dr. Watson and Dr. Eva. And I hope you liked it. I'll see you guys in a bird story. Until then, take care, y'all.